Let's pray together over day 34, holiness in life, holiness in the body. Lord, I give thanks to you today for the privilege to be your creation. Thank you that you know us perfectly and that you love us. You've made us with a physical body, and Jesus has one like ours. And someday we'll have one just like his, and we thank you for that. We thank you that your call to holiness isn't to some disembodied experience. It's not to some impractical life that has to wait for later when we're free of this physical shell. But instead, you have made us, you have made this body to be holy. So I want to thank you that that you call us to, to be holy at this moment, that our body is a temple of the Holy Spirit, that our whole spirit and soul and body can be preserved blameless, that we are to cleanse ourselves of all filthiness of flesh and spirit, and that our bodies should be a, a living sacrifice, holy and acceptable. And we can let sin not reign in our body. Uh, thank you, Lord, that, that you have told us in your word that, that we can be right with you and live lives of holiness with even with while we have drives and temptations in this life. And so we pray, O oh God, that you would sanctify our drives and sanctify our lives in such a way that we are able to discipline our bodies and uh, make, them, make them obey the, the Lord. Thank you, Lord, that you can take full control. So we just tell you again that we wish to surrender our bodies as a living sacrifice. Help us be holy, not only in spirit, but in body. And give us patience and discipline while we're waiting for the redemption of all things, including these physical bodies that you have blessed us with. Make us holy, spirit, soul, and body, we pray in Jesus' name. Let's continue praying and seeking the Lord together.